343 finally gave some information regarding major issues around Halo Infinite. Community Director Sketch posted this today on Halo Waypoint. In this post, he drops a pretty big wall of text. I just want to do my best to break it down and highlight the major changes they are addressing. First and foremost, I am very happy to say Big Team Battle and all the issues surrounding it are finally being addressed. More specifically, they announced the changes they plan to make are already in QA testing, even though they don't have a specified release date. Once a game, or update in this case, reaches this stage of testing, that means they are pretty far down the development timeline, so we should definitely expect this soon, which is great to hear. Even though Sketch doesn't give us a specific release date, he does give us a general timeline of what's happening. Basically just saying they're testing the patch currently and they're just going to have to clear certifications, which is great. Also in the same post, they also address the cheating issue. I know this hits home for a lot of people. Um, I haven't experienced too much cheating in this game, not that I know of. But I definitely know it's there. I've seen a lot of people struggle with cheaters in their games. But throughout the post, he constantly mentions this February patch that they're planning to roll out. And it seems like this is going to be a pretty big update. So definitely something to get excited over. Unfortunately, they don't really address anything about the monetization issues and the complaints people have. But hey, fixing Big Team Battle and addressing cheating is definitely steps in the right direction. I'm happy to see it. In a past video, I had a lot of criticism for 343. But seeing them address these issues and being pretty open with the community compared to other developers, it's definitely refreshing and it gives me hope. Halo Infinite has great core gameplay. For me personally, I very much enjoy it. It seems a lot of major publishers are abandoning their projects pretty early if they don't see initial success. It's great to see that they're listening to the community and seemingly want this game to last a long time, which is a great thing for the future of Halo. Personally, I think that. You can disagree. If you do, leave it in the comments. I do actively encourage discourse if everyone's being respectful. So... With all that being said, look forward to the future of Halo, and if you enjoyed, like, comment, subscribe. I will be following updates of this game, and thank you very much for watching.